Hi everybody, I'm Kirsten from the University of Lethbridge Art Gallery and welcome to Art Lab from Home. Today we'll be making watercolor paintings out of tissue paper. I hope you enjoy. So for this activity you will need watercolor paper, a brush, a little bit of water, and some tissue paper. It can be old tissue paper that you've used before or new tissue paper. You may have to experiment with what colors work the best. Um, I found that the purple, yellow, and blues work the best for me. So to start off, you're going to want to kind of think about if you want to make an image or if you want it to be abstract. You can use scissors, but I like to just tear my pieces and sort of set them around my paper in ways that I might think would look cool once they bleed into it. So I'm thinking about flowers today, so I might do something that makes me think of a bouquet of flowers like this. Maybe this will be the ground, and this will be background, whatever you like. It's also really fun to just do abstract shapes and colors, whatever you feel. So once you have all your pieces kind of ready, you are going to take your paintbrush and your water, and you're going to dip your paintbrush in the water so it's quite wet. Then you're going to take your piece and paint over top of it so that it sticks to the paper. Feel free to add more water so it really sticks on there. And then just continue doing that. Keep adding pieces, just painting them with water on top of your paper. This would be cool. It would look kind of like a mosaic if you wanted to make an image out of it. Or you could even overlap. So here where we have the yellow and the blue overlapping, it might create a green. And you can see maybe a little bit that the purple is already starting to bleed some of its ink onto the paper. So just keep adding pieces until you feel like you have enough. You can leave parts of your paper white if you like, or you can cover the whole thing. You can do really big bits like this if I wet my paper before I add it, and then I place it over top and it sticks that way. And I might add a little bit more water over top. So the water is essentially making the inks from the paper bleed out onto your watercolor paper. And like I said, some colors work better for this. I tested a pink piece of tissue paper, this one, and it did not work at all. No colors came out of it. And I also tested a red and an orange tissue paper, these ones. And you think they would be really pigmented, but no color came out of them either. So I'd recommend going through your old, your old storage of tissue paper and just seeing which colors work. You might have to do some experiments, which is the fun part. All right, maybe a little bit more yellow. And then we let it dry. So once you have it kind of how you want it, let it dry. So once you've completely let your page dry, you can carefully peel off the tissue paper to reveal the colors left behind. Some of it might stick a bit, but just gently peel it off. So if the colors aren't as vibrant as you want, you could go in with more pieces of tissue paper like this and just repeat the process 
adding more and more layers. So once you have your piece as colorful as you would like it, you could leave it as an abstract piece of art or you could draw into it if you like. Uh, like I mentioned, I've been thinking about flowers today. So I think I'm going to make mine a wild bouquet of flowers. And again, you don't have to draw into it, only if you feel like it. Whatever you'd like to do. And you can also keep layering on the tissue paper and keep applying water until it's as colorful as you'd like. It'll just get more and more intense. There! And there we have our colorful watercolor-esque bouquet of flowers. Here's another one I did earlier. Uh, you can see that the colors are really bright and saturated. I think I did three layers of tissue paper on it, and it's an abstract piece. All right, I hope you enjoyed making watercolor tissue paper paintings with me. Have a great day, bye. Thanks so much for joining us for watercolor tissue paper paintings. I hope you enjoyed. Be sure to check back our YouTube channel regularly for more videos. Bye.